Hey everybody, John Yard here. We're back at the firewood pile and today we're going to be talking about elm and whether elm is good firewood. So let me grab a piece of elm here. You gotta find it. Yeah, here's a piece of elm. Got one here. Uh, so is it good firewood? Let's answer that question. Uh, as we get started though, let me just make a, a quick note. There's a really easy way to identify elm firewood uh, that's kind of unique uh, among different types of wood and different types of trees. Elm is actually the only type of firewood where the annual rings, which is what it's always on the end grain of a tree or a piece of wood, and that's what you can use to count how old the tree is. So the annual rings on elm is wavy, all right? Almost like if you, you drop a pebble in a still pool of water and it starts to like ripple out and it's kind of uh, got waves on it. It kind of looks similar on, on the end grain of a piece of elm. And uh, because it's the only type of firewood that does that, uh, you can pretty easily identify it. So if you see that, then you almost definitely have a piece of elm. Uh, so is it good firewood though? The heat output of elm is not that great. Uh, it is, is pretty close to something like uh, a sycamore, uh, a pine, depending on the variety. So it has a pretty low uh, BTU or heat output. Um, it also is, is very, very difficult to split. So elm is famously hard to split. Especially, it's kind of surprising too because it's such a uh, sort of low density wood. Uh, but you might be able to tell here, these, these kind of pieces of wood that are coming off, elm is kind of stringy, all right? Almost like little pieces of basket reed coming off here. And because it's so stringy, it binds really tightly together, which makes it really hard to split. Um, so if you're not kind of up for the splitting challenge or not ready to, to put in some work to get your firewood, then elm might not be the, not, not, might not be the kind of firewood you want to use. Um, so what else? Something that's, that's great about elm is it actually has pretty good coaling properties. So once you get it burning, it'll uh, burn for a pretty long time. Uh, but overall, I would say elm is kind of in the, the meh, okay, fair category of firewood. It's not going to be uh, kind of the great stuff that you want to heat your, your house and the wood stove all, all winter long. But if you have a bunch of elm and uh, you don't have a lot of other stuff around, then you can still burn it. It's not going to hurt anything. Uh, but if you have oak or hickory or ash or uh, even, you know, hard maple like sugar maple, that's all going to be better than something like an elm. All right, that's all. There you have it. Cheers. You know, it would be awesome. It would be awesome if you subscribed to our YouTube channel.